Hello Year 6, my name is Mr Thurban, I'm Assistant Head Teacher at Sir John Lehman High School and I'm also in charge of maths, I'm the Head of Maths at the school. Some of you may recognise me from uh, the local football club, also some of you may recognise me from a local primary school as my son is also in Year 6 and he will also be coming up to the Lehman um, in September along with yourselves. Now I've been asked by Miss Francis to talk about a few things to do with maths some things that maybe you would have asked me if we'd had the parents' evening, um, just so that you are aware of what will happen in September with maths in Year 7. So some of the things are lessons. We have sort of 200-minute lessons um, a week with Year 7, and they will normally be with one maths teacher, um, and they will have them for all of those lessons. Homework, we normally set one piece of homework a week and normally it's in a booklet form and the students work through the booklet. We may go around the department in a little bit and you may get to see a little bit of that. Um, sets, what, we're doing in, what we do in secondary school um, is we put students into sets on their mathematical ability. Now as there were no sats for your year six, which is what we normally use to set them, um, what the, the primary school teachers have done is given us predicted SATS results for the Year 6 students. And we're going to use those to put, uh, put, put students into SATS for September. So roughly there will be a higher group, a middle group and a lower group. Um, and that's how, how we will do the SATS from, from day one of September. Um, from there though, we have obviously tests. Um, all year groups do tests sort of every term and there will be one for year seven around about half term and what we will do is we'll look at those tests and then change the sets accordingly so there was always opportunities to move to different sets depending on ability. The last thing I've been told to mention is a transition pack. You should be receiving or have already received a transition uh, pack, an academic, and obviously within it there is some maths information and basically we want, want you to sort of like tell us roughly what your ability is in the different areas that it highlights on this sheet. Um, so the first one for example is that you can subtract a three digit number from a three digit number. How do you feel about that? And then there are some questions which we would like you to answer without a calculator. And then there was a little bit of a, an open-ended task to show us some of your creative side and to explore things that you feel that you can tell us about maths. Okay, so we would like those completed if possible, but don't worry if you can't, uh, just do your best, um, that's all, all that we can ask. I think that's everything, thank you. This is our breakout area at the Lehman. Um, it's used by math students, but also used by skill students quite a lot. Um, when you have skills lessons, you'll come up here and use the computers and you'll use um, the breakout area. But also within maths, we get an opportunity to use this area as well. And it's quite good for doing mathematical work and it's quite good for doing treasure hunts that we like to do as well. But it's a really good space for doing skills work and for doing maths work as well. This is the Maths Corridor and this is where all of your maths lessons will be. And these are some of the maths displays.